you're out there, I'll find you. What the hell? No. Ranger! Damn. Oh, you. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. I don't know what we would have done without you, man. Oh, come on. Hey, Thank okay, you, all right, man. all right, all right. It's dead. It's cool. Man of the hour. Oh, God. I'm Russell. Glenn Russell. This is Private Mullins. Rick. Uh, hey, Rick. Uh, I'm Deacon St. John. Did, did you say private? Yeah. Yes, sir. The Shoots County Militia. You're not from around here. You come over the pass? Uh, no, no, no. I've just been uh, drifting. I came over the uh, salt flats east of Silver Lake. <sighs> what? What the hell are you doing out here, man? How'd you get across the 97? Whoa, 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 whoa. Jesus, man. What? This guy just saved your freaking life. The colonel told us to look out for anybody entering the territory, north or south. Freaking slow your roll, man. We'll let the captain deal with that, okay? Fine. Get he just killed a freaking ranger, dude! Come with us. We got a camp just by Diamond Lake. Get you three hots in a cot. Least we can do. Okay, yeah, sounds good. What about Flores? We can't just leave him here. Uh, you stay here. I'll come back with some fuel. No! Listen, stay here. Use his ammo if you gotta. You'll be fine. Okay? Following you. You gotta stick with me, okay? Been having some trouble with squatters out here the past few weeks. A patrol picks you up, could be trouble. Okay, got it. So, uh, the shoots county militia? Look, man, all I know is they feed me. They want me to salute and yes, sir. I salute and say yes, sir. How big's your outfit? Camp out here? We got a hundred, maybe more. Hard to keep track. Back at HQ, a whole lot more than that. Yeah, okay. Uh, any women? Hell, that what you're about? Well, you can forget it. Colonel's got rules about that. Frat, fratern, fratern, fraternizing. <laughs> yeah, that. Look, you pull your weight, follow orders, nobody messes with you. Women, same as the men. Don't matter to the Colonel. I'm not, uh... Listen, I, I'm just, I'm looking for some people and a woman that I rode with a year back or so. They would have come over from Silver Lake, and they would have been at one of those Nero refugee camps, I think. Silver Lake? Jesus, man. Silver Lake's been gone a lot longer than that. Yeah, yeah. I, it's too goddamn easy to lose track of time out of here, you know? Anyway, you guys, uh, do you pick anyone up? Survivors, I mean, from, uh, from the refugee camp. Maybe. Like I said, it's a big freaking army, you know? Ask the captain. He came in across the salt flats, I think. He might know. The captain? Yeah, Corey. He commands the Diamond Lake outpost. We're almost there. This is it. It's Corporal Russell. Open. Report. Captain, sir, we had him. We did. Found his bike still smoking. I bet you lost him, huh? No, sir. I mean, yeah, we lost them. We ran into a rager, sir. Where's Mullins? Flores? Flores is dead, sir. I'll have Mullins with a body. That'll be all, Corporal. Go get some fuel. Head back to Mullins. You know what to do. Yeah. Yes, sir. If it wasn't for this man, we'd all be dead, sir. I sort of promised him some food and a... Safe place to camp tonight, sir. Corporal, get the fuck out of here. And you are? Name's Deacon St. John. Name's Corey. Derek Corey. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm sorry. Um, I'm sorry, I'm a little tired. I've been on the road for a long time. Your man Russell said you were recruiting. Are you interested? I've been looking to settle down, yeah, find a camp. I'm interested. Come on. 
So, how long have you been drifting? Hard to say. Uh, you lose track of time out there, you know? So, uh, where'd you get your gear? Ammo. Well, there was a couple of camps I used to do runs for. Bounty hunting, mostly. Freaks? Or men? Both. I had a reputation for being able to track shit down, you know? Uh, which camps? Where are they? You know, past the Farewell Valley. It doesn't matter. They're gone now. They're overrun. Uh, Russell said you were there when Silver Lake was overrun? <laughs> uh, yeah. That was a shit show, I can tell you. Uh, any survivors? A few. Here. Take this. Militia script. Camp credits. Payment for helping my men. Use them at any of the commissaries. Okay. You gonna join up? Stick around. We're getting ready to ride out of here soon. Getting ready to ride out where? You said you had some tracking skills. Yeah, some. This isn't the life of a drifter. We're fighting a war out here. You sure you're up for it? Is that the best you got? I can recruit you. But the colonel is the only one who can swear you in. You stick around. Give us a hand. I'll take you to him myself. I'll be here. Good. Oh, Jesus. Jesus, motherfucker, has my ring. He took it from Sarah. He had to take it from Sarah because she wouldn't have given it to him. So that means that she's got to be here. Hey, uh, you don't look very militia to me. No, nah, um, man, name's Wade. Wade Taylor. You can call me Wade. Deacon St. John. <laughs> Holy Listen. shit. Deacon St. John? Is your old man a preacher or something? No. Man, that is a hell of a name. All right, listen. You Wade. see this, man? This is some crazy shit. Yeah. Whew. So what, you joining up, becoming an army man, you playing soldier and shit? I don't know, maybe. Listen, mm -hmm. uh, you look like you just came in from out the shit, right? Yeah, man, yesterday. Okay, yesterday. I've been... been waiting to see the colonel, whatever the hell that is. Traveling with some people, we got separated. You see mm -hmm. anyone that looked like this around here? Uh, nah, man. Ooh, she is a looker. I'd hit that, you know. <laughs> uh, I gotta go, man. They're checking me for lice or some shit. Good luck to you, Deacon St. John. Jesus, what a name. Jesus, that dude's fucked up. He wouldn't remember Sarah if she slapped him in the face. You're getting ready to ride out. You still coming? Ready when you are. Looks like you put a lot of work into this. Yeah, some. It looks like a forest fire, but the stumps are charred. So that means, that means that the timber was cut before it was burned. You got a good eye. We call it the dead zone. We use the timber to build our barricades, then burn the slash. From the outpost, we can see a horde coming long before it reaches us. And what? You're gonna burn all the buildings too, so the newts and the swarmers have nowhere to sleep? And you know you're freaks, huh? Like I said, I've been out in the ship for a long time. So that's your plan, huh? The militia, I mean, to burn everything to the ground? We're fighting a war out here, St. John. We'll do whatever it takes to win. A war? That's what it is, isn't it? A war? You've been out in this shit. You've seen the hordes. The only thing that's gonna stop them is an army. Our army. It's gonna take way more than an army. We have a plan. If the colonel lets you join, we'll fill you in. So, Silver Lake, you asked about survivors. You looking for someone? No. No, not really. I mean, look, there were some folks that I rode with once, and I thought maybe they ended up there. Uh, I thought maybe you were after someone. For a bounty, I mean. Yeah, no. I tracked men over long distances before, but not this far. No bounty's worth that. Hey, Corporal. The captain's here. 
It's done, sir. Make sure you make a marker. Yes, sir. All right. You two head back to Diamond Lake. Grab, uh, Taylor was his name? Yes, sir. Yeah. Take him to the Colonel. I'll be there in 1800. Sir? Military time, Corporal. You're supposed to know this by now. Oh, yes, sir. Get the fuck out of here. Yes, sir. You find something? Uh, how long is, uh, Vasquez? How long has Vasquez been with you guys? A couple of weeks, maybe more. <laughs> well, he's been busy. What the hell? You guys been having trouble with supply runs, marauder attacks? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna go on foot from here. On foot? Why? <laughs> because Vasquez came out here for a reason. I can't track him from the bike. Where do we start? It's been snowing, so uh, there won't be any boot prints. Come on, I want to look inside the cabin. Okay, I'm following you. <clears throat> you said he stole rations, ammo? Yes. This is an MRE. It's half eaten, so looks like your men rode up on him when he wasn't expecting it. His bike's still out front, which means that he went out the back. Wait, over here. What would you find? The fence has been cut. There we go. And no rust. So it was cut recently? Yeah, come on, this way. Stop to shoot at something. Come on, down here. Hold up, hold up. Go on, get out of here. What are you doing? That ever work for you? Yelling at a roof? <laughs> Depends. On what? Look out, more wolves! I see him. You guys got a lot of wolves out here? Ones that aren't infected, I mean? Yeah, we get reports almost every day. When I was a kid growing up, there were no wolves in Oregon. I mean, a few coyotes, but no wolves. They'd been driven to extinction by ranchers and farmers, timber companies. Well, it looks like they're making a big comeback. Wait, get down. A swarm. A Nero gravesite. This one is marked on our map. They're scattered all over the region. Yeah, maybe that explains why uh, Vasquez came through here. Let's go around. Exactly what I was thinking. What do you think? Is anyone else tracking him? Not that I know of. Huh. No, but he's either dead. Or he's got a lot of friends. You see how his tracks have been overridden by bikes. A lot of bikes. Hmm. Okay. Come on. Let's see where they're heading. You said cold weather brings out the freaks? Yeah, yeah. Cold, snow, rain, hell, even clouds. Well, like I said before, you know your freaks. When we get to command, there's some people who want to talk to you. People? The Colonel will fill you in. If he lets you join? Yeah, yeah, I think I said that already. Look, he runs a tight outfit. I just don't want you to get your hopes up. Hey, don't worry about me. Hey, wait, hear that? Yeah, yeah it's coming from the logging camp over there. Is that on your map? Yeah. Wow, oh, that means it's also on Vasquez's map. Come on. If Vasquez is there, what would your strategy be? Well, he's not alone. We know that from the tracks. What's that militia penalty for going AWOL? Hanging by the neck until dead. Why? Well, it means Vasquez isn't coming without a fight. Do you see your man? Yeah. That's him. Oh, looks like you guys need to start doing background checks on your recruits. He seems to be right at home. Well, let's wait here. I'll radio for backup. Get your goddamn hands off me! Oh, this one's a fighter, boys! On. What do you think? Oh, come on, Vasquez. Oh, see about that. <laughs> What? Uh, I just got this problem with assholes who hurt unarmed women. I'm giving you an order. Order? <laughs> you see me wearing a red armband? You don't give me orders yet. You do whatever the hell you want. You stay behind me. Give me cover if you have to. Shoot him! Shoot him! Out. Like 
last of them? Yeah. I think so. Nice work. Come on, let's go deal with your man. Vasquez? He isn't my man. Hmm. Not anymore. I don't want to hit him. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Easy, easy. I'm not gonna... I'm just here to help. I don't need your goddamn help. Okay. I'm just gonna move over here. Get the hell away from me! Hold on, hold on now. We're not with them. You think I give a damn who you are? Okay. Okay. What the hell was that? Just your typical damsel in distress. Vasquez? Done. Way done. Captain Corey? Come in. This is Corey. We're here. Heading up the road to the main gate. Hold your position there. We're coming. What about the enemy? They've been, uh, uh neutralized. Uh, hold your position. Curry out. We brought up your bikes, Captain. Thought we'd save you the walk back. That'll be all, Corporal. So how'd I do? Did I pass? Pass? Oh, you've been watching me all day. I figured this was what? Some kind of test. <laughs> No. Nothing quite as formal as all that. As you can see, our pool of recruits isn't what it used to be. <laughs> yeah. But yeah. You passed. Third day in a row. Oh. You ready to meet the colonel? <laughs> yeah, sure. Why the hell not? 